Today's Gospel, Monday, August 15, is taken from St. Luke, chapter 1, verses 39 to 56. Mary set out and traveled to the hill country in haste to a town of Judah, where she entered the house of Zechariah and greeted Elizabeth. When Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the infant leaped in her womb, and Elizabeth, filled with the Holy Spirit, cried out in a loud voice and said, Most blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. And how does this happen to me, that the mother of my Lord should come to me? For at the moment the sound of your greeting reached my ears, the infant in my womb leaped for joy. Blessed are you who believe that what was spoken to you by the Lord would be fulfilled. And Mary said, My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked upon his handmaid's lowliness. Behold, from now on will all ages call me blessed. The Mighty One has done great things for me, and holy is His name. His mercy is from age to age to those who fear Him. He has shown might with His arm, dispersed the arrogant of mind and heart. He has thrown down the rulers from their thrones, but lifted up the lowly. The hungry He has filled with good things, the rich he has sent away empty. He has helped Israel his servant, remembering his mercy, according to his promise to our fathers, to Abraham, and to his descendants forever. Mary remained with her about three months, and then returned to her home. The Gospel of the Lord Today's Faith Food Reflection is from Brother Selton Sindo of the Hand of the Sower Catholic Community. Tanong, Bakit daw wala si Maria sa larawan ng The Last Supper? Eh siya kasi ang photographer. Hindi to joke. Hindi ba't yun naman talaga ang laging papel ng mahal na birhen? Lagi lamang siyang nasa background ng mahahalagang pangyayari sa buhay ng ating Panginoon. Ngayon ay ipinagdiriwang ng simbahan ang dakilang kapistahan ng pag-aakyat kay Maria sa langit, katawan at kaluluwa, kasama ng kanyang anak na si Jesus. Ang doktrinang ito ay nagpapahayag sa katuparan ng pinangako ng ating Panginoon na may langit na naghihintay sa sino mang sa kanya ay nagtitiwalang tunay. At nakamit nga ng mahal na ina ang titulong ito, hindi sa pamamagitan ng sarili niyang kapangyarihan, kundi dahil siya ay naging kabilang ng mga nasa abang kalagayan. Silang nangagugutom at nasa background lamang ng lipunan. Ang pag-aakyat sa langit kay Maria ay nagbibigay pag-asa sa atin Nasa gitnaman ng ating pagtangis dito sa bayang kahapis-sapis, ay may isang mapagmahal na Diyos na handa tayong pagkalooban ng kaginhawaang lubos. Katulad ng kanyang gantimpala kay Maria, susuklian din ng kanyang kalwalhatian ang lahat ng ating katapatan. Let us pray. Mary assumed into heaven, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.